Hello and welcome to We Are Finn and we're here with uh, GKN at the Farnborough International Air Show for 2022. With me now I have Max Brown from GKN. Welcome to We Are Finn first of all. Thank you Andy. I'm very pleased to be here. Now, we were watching a little while ago um, a presentation that was taking place downstairs about the uh, H2 gear programme. That's been running for 18 months now, hasn't it? How has that 18 months been going? Uh, well, it's been a really, really busy 18 months. Um, we, we've basically had to set the team up from pretty much scratch. So we now have a team of about 70 to 80 engineers and technologists. Um, and we've been developing the hydrogen electric propulsion system under the H2 gear programme. Um, from very basic uh, preliminary concepts right the way through to now some notional aircraft architectures that you would have seen in the, uh, in the presentation that we uh, prepared earlier. Yeah, and in that presentation you gave us quite an important update on the programme so far. Yeah, we did, we did. So when we started, we, we initially felt that, that the smaller aircraft was probably going to be the sweet spot for us and the team were very focused on 19-seat passenger aircraft and we went through a series of uh, aircraft level and system level architectural studies to, to understand whether that was optimum. And, and what we found is that as, our, as our knowledge base grew and some of our technical development was better understood, we suddenly realised that we could actually scale that aircraft concept. So we then looked at 48-seat and, and then we even went up to 96 passenger aircraft um, seating. And to our surprise and to our you know, excitement that we realised that with some of the technologies that we're now developing, we now believe that we can actually scale the hydrogen electric propulsion system into those potentially larger aircraft uh, area and therefore have a bigger benefit on trying to achieve the net zero uh, ambitions that as an industry we really need to you know all be heavily focused on. As you say the industry is focused on that sustainability and net zero and getting there as fast as they can. Uh, is the industry beating your door down at the moment? <laughs> well I, I guess you know I, I work in the CTO office I'm in the Horizon 3 our, our job is to look explore new technologies so by design it's we develop capability that as a business we might not naturally have so not only are we looking at our existing customers but potentially we will have new customers and what we've found is that by developing our knowledge base and by you know, developing some of the key technology like the cryogenic electrical network that, that we um, that Simon Taylor, our, our product group director, explained to the, the audience earlier this morning. What we found is that a lot of our customers are now coming to talk to us about, OK, that's interesting. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Can you tell us about the challenges? Can you tell us about the opportunities, the efficiency improvements that we can gain? Um, and, and in addition to that, we're seeing new customers come to us as well. So um, it's a really exciting space for us. Uh, we, we're constantly thinking about what's the next strategy for us, you know, who are the key partners, both in the UK but also globally, um, in order to then take our, our product demonstration to the next level. Max, thank you very much and I wish you the best for the future on this project. Thank you very much, Andy.